the loss in the wind. We gotta stand up on our tiptoes. Shout to the world. It's our life. I couldn't touch it from the get go. We're gonna be so bright. Gonna be so Referee is set to drop the puck on this one. Rosters are ready alongside Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski, ready to call all the action in this one. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. The Huskies take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Boston's got control of the puck, and the shot dies in the traffic jam. Swing and a miss. Crosby's got the puck in his own zone. Intercepts it at center. The Dogs look to start the transition game. And the linesman calls icing on the play. Start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Makes the save. From behind the net. Centering pass. Big time stop. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Slides the puck ahead to Johns. Slides it diagonally to Couture. Boston's got the puck along the boards. Picked up along the boards by Phillips. Couldn't catch up to that pass. And that pass is stolen. A chance in front. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Phillips is whacked with a slash. Delayed penalty coming up. Scores! Oh, what a one-timer to bury it! I don't think the goaltender gets a look at this at all, James. He just drops into the butterfly. He's hoping the thing hits him through that traffic. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Into the middle of the neutral zone. To his teammate! Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Wrists one, gives him nothing in front. Had to be sharp, that's a great A chance. Quick pass to Bill. Big play inside the defensive zone. Going after that loose puck by any means necessary. Montreal's on the attack. On the doorstep. The Dogs have a hold of it in the defensive zone. From the right side, takes the pass. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Deflected in front. He scores! In the Hang on, wait a second here, Ray. Yeah, I, I, this is, this is good. waved off on the ice. They'll have to take a look to see whether this is a distinct kicking motion or not. Well, the referee's not gonna be very popular, is he? He reverses the call on the ice after talking to the league office. This goal will count. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Boston's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Puck grabbed by Couture. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Butchers won a big draw on their own end. Bertrand's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Nady. Great positioning in the defensive end. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. Passes it to Mitchell. 
Mitchell's got it along the wing. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. 2-0 is where we sit. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. He got all of that one. What a great read breaking up the pass. The offensive player with the lead. you got to be sure with the puck. You can't turn it over in that spot. Puts the puck on net. Answer. He scores! That's how you do it. Leadership to a team. The captain capitalizes. Montreal's cut that lead to one as they get back to center ice. They must look at this game completely different, James. They should. Because now, with just half of this first period left, there's lots of time. You only trail by one. The dogs scoop it up along the boards. It's a two-on-one. Taken along the wall by Crosby. Comes up with the steal. Good reach of the stick to knock the puck away. Bill's got it deep in the offensive end. From the top of the offensive zone here. And that's broken up. Still to come in period number two. Lots of action on the ice. And up in the broadcast booth, business will pick up. The iconic Snoop Dogg will join us here. Here in the dying moments of this period, the Huskies still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. Clearing attempt, and he's able to move the puck across the goal line and out of harm's way. Here he is in front, and that goes off the iron and stays out. Scooped up along the wall by Johns. Great glove save. Yeah, he got a little testy once the whistle blown. He's pushing him out of there. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Grabs the puck. Moves it quickly over to Butcher. Oh, wow! What a save with the glove! Montreal's down, but not out. They've had chances. They just haven't capitalized. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Feeds the puck to Phillips. Slides the puck over to Johns. Knocked away. Carries it in. Clock ticking down here inside the first period. Stopped by the goaltender. Montreal's down despite numerous scoring opportunities here late in the first. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Feeds the puck over to Johns. Quick feed to Bill. And with just seconds to spare, they get a goal here to close things out. You gotta look at it from both ways. That's a real kick in the pants for the team that gave up the goal. But what a boost of energy for them to score this late in the period. That's about as lucky as you can get. You need some puck luck most of the time to win. There's a good chunk of it. Montreal's still trailing here in this opening period despite excellent scoring opportunities in the offensive zone. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Moves it to Phillips. Passes it over to Johns. Mitchell's been tripped up and we got a penalty coming up here. Lots more action on the ice continues in period number two, and business picking up in the broadcast booth, too, when the legendary Snoop Dogg joins us here on EA Sports. period.
Montreal sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. And so they'll get their first power play of the evening. At the very least, you want to make sure you get pucks to the net, win some puck battles so you retrieve the puck. You just do not want on your first power play to have a poor one because that... Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. There's the whistle, and this power play will come to an end as another man's off to the box. Pretty cut and dry from up here, and the official saw it firsthand with hooking the call. It's a penalty of being in bad position, and I think when you impede a player like this, they should call the hooking penalty every time. Wrist shot from the slot! Oh, drop the dime on him, man. What a shot! almost gave up on this. He can't find the puck and he just stands there. This thing beats him cleanly. He never saw it. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Stars sell the game here, Snoop. Who are some of the guys that you cheered for? Man, Marcel Dion back in the days. I still love the way he got out on the Mew. And of course, 99. Gretzky, the great one. Have you heard that, Wayne? Man, me and Wayne, I'm, I'm the greater one. You're the great <laughs> That's my nephew. <laughs> Boston's looking to break out of their own end. And that's intercepted. Montreal's done a really nice job positionally tonight. They've stolen the puck every time, it seems, when they needed to. Slides the puck near the front of the net. From the point, they take control of it. Right in front! The Huskies have it from their own end. The Dogs have it in the offensive end. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Butcher's looking to break out from behind his own net. Turns the puck over. Great read defensively there. A little bump and grind, but still hangs on to the puck. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Carries it across the line. Let's it go. And puts it right over the crossbar. All right, if you're an in-game presenter, you're in charge of presenting a hockey game tonight for the crowd. How do you present it? How does Snoop roll it out? First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put some lights, camera, and a whole lot of action. We're going to have some beautiful people in the house to bring on the introduction. And the game is going to be fun-filled. We're going to do it outdoors. We're going to make it outdoors. That's what we're going to do. Take the party outside. Take it outside. Picked up along the wall by Couture. And now he moves it to Nady. Takes a shot. Shuts him down. Gets it out of his own end. Moves it around along the half wall. He clearly doesn't like that. Bertrand's done everything here except pull the other guy's gloves off. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. You got into hockey at a young age listening to Chick Hearn. Favorite team growing up? Favorite team growing up would have to be L.A. Kings. What about the Ducks-Kings rivalry? Is there something there now? I think it's a little rivalry there, considering that the Ducks did happen to win the, you know, Stanley Cup once upon a time, and, uh, you know, that, that rubs, you know, rubs the right way when you can win one of them fans. Hey, look, I know I'm no Chick Hearn, but you want to still hang around, watch the rest of this period? Look here, James, I got a little bit of time on my hand. Let's do it, baby. Let's enjoy this. There he is. He's going to hang out with us. Let's go. Montreal's had a lot of good looks on net, but they continue to trail here in the second. Moves it to Nady. Takes the feed. And now it's grabbed by Johns. Slides it over to Crosby. Puck scooped up by Butcher. And here's the pass to Mitchell. The Huskies get a hold of the puck along the boards. Bill's taking it from his own end. And it's a quick pass to Crosby. No! Wow. Oh, can I have a pillow with that hit? <laughs> he blew him up. And a blanket. Thank you. You're going to bed on that one? Right now. Shutting it down. Ladies and gentlemen, Snoop Dogg. Good night. Strong feed from along the boards. Big time save with the blocker. Grabbed along the board by Crosby. Passes over to Nady. And he moves it up to Mitchell. Boston's got the puck in their own end. Quick pass to Crosby. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. No, that... Uh-uh. See? What a hit. It was too high. Too high. The hit was too high, man. Get lower, a little bit lower. You got to aim for the mid-section. I like how you are now breaking down the areas of hitting. I yeah, love it. man. You got to break that down, man. You want it to be, you know, take him off his fist knee so he can keep it me out of moving. This is why we have the D-O-double-G up in the broadcast booth tonight. Please believe it when I tell you this.
And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. Oh, here's another power play, James. They haven't been very good so far tonight. Nothing to show for their previous attempts. So now you have to get back to it, adjust, and re-attack on this man advantage. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Sends a pass over. Stones him in front. Montreal's got a hold of it against the wall. Boston's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Along the half wall with the puck. And loses possession after a solid hit. Comes up with the stop. Gains control of the puck here at the blue line. Takes the puck behind his own cage. And manages to clear the zone. From their own end, time winding down here on this power play. they got to get something going here. Yeah, you got to get into the zone first, James. Get it set up, start moving the puck around. But they've got to get into the zone quickly. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Great defensive stick work on the play. Well, I like this, James. They've really cycled the puck well on this shift. Now they can hold it, and you put the pressure on the defenders. Eventually, they pull you down, or you get a great chance. Gets the puck over to Thor. And he coughs it up with the pass. Keeps hold of the puck. Boston's got the puck. Slides the puck to Johns. One minute left. Johns plays it period. against the boards. Denies him on the play. Phillips has the puck against the half wall. Big hit on the play. He's not missed many of these. Every time he gets the puck, they seem to target him, and he's not been able to elude anybody. Here's a sprint for the loose puck. All right, Snoop, you know what time it is, right? Oh, yeah. It's time for the play to appear. You know it. Okay, let's go with the big hit for the big dog. Give me that big hit for the... Listen to the dog, father. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Here we go. Put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far. Ray, how do you see things? Montreal's been chasing this game and chasing the puck much of the first two periods. If they're going to get back in it, they've got to possess the puck a lot more. We're still in the early stages of this period. 3-2 is where we sit. It's a one-goal game in what has been a very fun contest to this point. On their heels, trying to clear. Gets it out of his own end. Taken by Phillips. And he passes it up ahead to Crosby. Putting the hard hat on here. What a hit. He's doing the best he can here. He just wants to get himself off the ice as quickly as he can. Looks like he's on the limp here a little bit. Great defensive effort with the strip. Bills lugging the puck. Through center along the wing. Picked up along the boards by Mitchell. Boston's ready to go on the attack. Knocks the puck loose. Thorne's got it against the boards. Breaks up the pass in the defensive zone. Montreal's done a great job without the puck. Nice pick off there. This game's close because of what the Makes his presence known on the ice. Here's an offensive chance. And that's picked off. Directed over to Butcher. Look out, a two-on-one. Sends it over. He scores! They tie it up! Brand new game. All that work that's gone behind this, and we're back to even Steven. Really quick puck movement always helps when you've got the extra man. The defenders just don't catch up to it, and it ends up in the net. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Unleashes a cannon! Oh, what a stop! 
six minutes, five seconds. Takes the puck along the boards. Puck picked up by Crosby. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. The dogs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Oh, just a textbook hit. Couture's got it in the defensive end. Butcher's eyes are looking for three. He's got two in his back pocket. Dangerous player now. Boston's got control of it now from their own end. Puck grabbed by Crosby. Montreal's got possession at center. And now it's over to Mitchell. With the blast! And a great save! Boston's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And look at this, a three-on-one. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Centering pass in front. Stick save. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Here's a short pass to Butcher. Montreal's got it from behind the net. From the back of the cage with the puck. Picks up the puck in his own end. And he slides it quickly to Thor. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. timeout down at ice level here, Ray. Uh, both teams get to catch their breath and maybe reorganize a little bit. Lots of times there's not much said at these timeouts. Past the midway mark of the frame, we got a tie game. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Big time stop there. Great reflexes, another save. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Sent into the opposite side. Good hit to pump him off the puck. The dogs scoop it up along the boards. Gets that puck back on a stick. Johns moves it ahead. Moves it quickly over to Crosby. Strong defensive effort. Beautiful cross ice feed inside the zone. Gets it out of his own end. Thorn stick handling in his own zone. And a penalty is coming up as the play is whistled dead here. Nady's getting called for two minutes here by the officials. He'll be heading to the penalty box for a couple of minutes. That's a charging penalty every day of the week. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And now he moves it quickly to Thor. Here's a shot. Shuts him down. Finds some space in the corner. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. Tripping is the call, and it's pretty cut and dry, it seems, Ray. Well, it's like you... You're in position, then you're not. You reach out, you trip him up, and there's no way to get out of it now. What an opportunity here for the man advantage unit. It's a five-on-three with plenty of time to work. There's been times tonight this power play has looked pretty good. There's been other times they've kicked it around like they've never been on the ice together before. Critical time in this game. What an opportunity for them. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Boston's regained possession of the puck. There's the go-ahead goal, and we have a new game. Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace, you push the other guys back on their heels. Boston's coaches are pretty active on the bench there, Ray. What are you hearing? Well, they're happy that they've got the lead, but they want to make sure that nobody sits back to defend. Trying to clear, and mission accomplished, Ray. Yeah, late in the game, it's defensive blue line, puck out, offensive blue line, puck in. Nothing turned over at those two spots. John shows good hands collecting the pass. He's already got the tiebreaker earlier on. Wait out in front. The dogs have it against the wall. Shot gets tipped, and he gets his glove out to stop the pinball shot. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Butcher's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And clearing attempt is a big success on that play. 
Quick feed to Bill. Slides it across. And that one's turned away. Here in the later stages of this period, Boston's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. And now it's grabbed by Crosby. Great save by the goaltender to get a pat on that one. Keeping the puck out of the net. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. On the attack along the boards. Let's it go. Blocked in front. The Huskies gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves it to Butcher. The Dogs gain possession in their own end. Moves the puck from off the bank pass. Phillips carries the puck in his own zone. Penalty expires, and when you look at where things sit right now, that's a huge, huge play by the penalty killers. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Nine seconds remaining. Taken along the wall by Crosby. And that'll close the book on this one as the final horn sounds. If you can control the puck, you control the pace of the game. And I thought that had a lot to do just